Hello, 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 everybody. We return for a bit more Pokemon Mystery Dungeon Blue Rescue Team. Once again, I just got kind of in Arkham City because it's just like, oh yeah, something new. But we have returned to see if we can... That was a bit weird, but okay. Do. But yeah, see if we can continue and start the post-game to this. Just overall and everything. Well, no, I, I, we're just gonna get out of here. So now we need to make the biggest decision. Do we want to evolve our friend? Do we want to evolve the dear buddy? Or if we want to just have it be unevolved for the post game. But we will see. At least Shane is like, hi, Shmi. <laughs> Seems a little tense. Alright, you're already on the team. Good, good. I probably already knew that. Me just being dumb because it's been five billion years since I actually did anything. But yeah, let's see. What's on the job list today, Billy? We have a uh, frosty forest and two sky tower and two magma cavern. I guess we'll go ahead and take the magma cavern since we should be able to do that decently, decently. We have two Reviver Seeds. I've got my Stamina Band on. I should probably take some rocks. Like, put in my Gravel Rocks and then take Gravel Rocks out. I would like to store my Gravel Rocks. And then I'll take Gravel Rocks out. So, therefore, uh, they won't be, like, uh, two stacks. Because that's a weird thing that happens sometimes. Sometimes, and I guess maybe we should take like a bunch of gummies and just feed the team. I'll take a uh, just some gummies so we can increase. Oh, yeah, apparently, Ginseng is a permanent boost. Yeah, apparently, it's a permanent boost. I did not know that. Oh, there was a thing we were specifically looking for in here. Oh yeah, gravel racks. All right. Uh, I guess we'll just take eighty. Thank you, Mrs. Kangaskhan. Because I forget exactly why I'm just like, yes, we should increase everything super much, yes, when it comes to IQ. Because I think I was reading the Bibbidi Bop TV Tropes page for this game. And something in there just made me go like, yes, we must <laughs> freaking increase the IQ immediately. Let's see, because we also have, like, the Southern Cage, Solar Cave, and Waterfall Pond. That we should probably also explore, because they have appeared and might mean things. But we're gonna just have a, a simple go with a dungeon that we are already familiar with. Even though this might... Your client... Oh, boy. I should have brought more Reviver Seeds. But yes, I la, 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 la. wonder tile. All right, so there's just two wonder tiles next to each other. Because that's another thing that I'm out on the la, 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 on the lookout for. I almost said outlook for is that uh, there are new tiles, new tiles added to the diddly d. But yeah, when it comes to the ginseng. I will probably uh, have to link some, like, oh, no, 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 no. <sighs> Dumbass. Why? I hate this. Dumbass client, get away from enemies. Kind of annoying that, like, oh, I guess it used a... 
I don't know. Maybe one tried to throw a steak thing at it, but I don't think if one has picked up a steak. You know, the little spike throwers. Silver spikes there. But... If, I guess that's the only thing that would explain why it didn't go through the diddly D last time. Oh yeah, but onto the thing that I was talking about. We'll probably have to uh, just super link the abilities and go to a normal dungeon and just drink a bunch of ginseng for both of for all the teammates that are important. We must destroy you. Be gone. Get pumped on death. No, no. I need to put Shane on murder. To properly block. Because I think I took it off for some reason. Tactics. Go after foes. Please. Dear God. We will wait until we get to a safe place. This seems like a... Hmm, I'm trying to be like... What's a good orientation to make sure that our client doesn't get nuked from orbit from a random enemy that's like, I'm gonna kill you now. Yeah, I'm just going to eat some gummies. Type advantage master. I'll have to look at that. Let's see, silver gummy, what does that do? Steel type, who cares? You may have it. And then I shall eat the Sky Gummy. But yeah. After that sudden destruction of our client, we're just going to uh, super speed our way through this as much as possible. And probably run into a goddamn garbage can. Prob- And the client's gonna get annihilated, isn't they? I fear. Come on. Come on, you stupid. I got rocks. I need to replace my rocks because I forgot. I put the rocks back in. But that means I just need to set them. And now, get rocked, idiot. Get... Oh, fuck. How dare you. You don't like getting rocked? You vile bastard bitch. They, when they came in for the pincer attack, that was a big oh-no moment. Because <laughs> it's just like, if I stay here and fight this bastard, the little bastard's going to come around and gank our client, and I can't have that. We only have two reviver seats. Shadow Ball. I'm just, I'm scared of open entrances that are, like, right at an intersection with our client now. Because I'm just like, any moment now, a random enemy Pokemon is going to step from the shadows and just nuke our poor, poor client. Fear has taken over. Like, right now, I am in fear. Nightmare, nightmare, nightmare. I fear for the day that our client just gets ganked. These lava pools, in which fire Pokemon can just walk around and do whatever they want. More fear. I am in perpetual agony. I should have brought fate. I should have brought fate so that we could properly protect. Note to self. When having an escort, for the love of God, bring a third Pokemon. <laughs> Granted, that might mean that uh, the formation gets screwed up and the, uh, the client is forever on the outer rim of society. But I would like to have the potential... Don't kill the client, please, for the love of God. Run to the exit! 
fear is gripping me. Okay, that's not that bad. I, I thought you were going to do something like explosion. Or another magnitude that would somehow hit our poor, poor client. You dare try and smog me? You can't even mug me. Mugmar. We have to destroy you as quickly as possible because you have explosion. We need to be real careful when it comes to Gravelers. Because out of nowhere, they could just do a thing and kill us. Kill us all. Quit fire punching me! I'm a beloved baby boy! Please don't ex- I just realized if you ex- No, I think explosion is just a 3x3 three three radius. It isn't actually- it doesn't extend to the partner Pokemon behind you. Ow. Once again, fear- oh wait, when I- I fucked up. I fucked up majorly. Please do not poison sting from the Aether, my poor client. Beat up the rock man. I hate you. We don't even get the credit for it. I would like an exit to appear now. If an exit could uh, provide its tush, it would be very nice. Why did your beloved have to go deep into hell? Why did you follow my movement? How we were going to super bang up that Arbok. Oh, hey. A TM. Nice. I hope we don't have to fight, hopefully, we won't have to fight Moltres. Oh wait, no, this isn't even Moltres. This is Groudon. That's worse. <laughs> I was just like, oh, I hope we don't have to fight one of the legendary birds without having the friend area for it. Wait a minute, this isn't the fire mountain. This is the underground fire caves. I don't want to go now because then you're just going to throw another spike and hit the client. Okay, good. Now you're not going to hit the client now. <laughs> like, I was just analyzing its pattern of behavior, and it's just like, my client's going to fucking get shaped. Oh, hey, it's a mobile! You want to join the team, buddy? I think I have your area. Oh, sadness. Super effective. Two damage. You have failed. Go home. Do not become a family man. We must kill this snake. It looks kind of weird in silhouette. Level up time! Yay! My stat blocks are still kind of shit. <laughs> Hello, Graveler. You want to open up the... I knew you are going to do that. Thank you, client, for not getting in the way. Because if you went there, you would have died. <laughs> Fear. Fear is taking hold of me. We're getting so many red gummies. We need to eat some. All right. You can have this one. Let's see. What is gray gummy? Rock type. And have at it. Ooh, Trap Avoider. That seems like a good. That seems like a good. Let's see. Uh, check IQ. Need to go all the way down. See what we have. Exclusive move user. Will only use moves. It will not use a regular attack. Oh, wow. It's the IQ move that all the developers of 
the more modern Pokemon Mystery Dungeon games really liked, apparently. To the point that apparently Mystery Dungeon DX doesn't have a normal attack? And I hate it. Item Master. Will use or throw its hold item. Dedicated Traveler. We know that. Self-Cure. Trap Avoider. That just sounds good. Often avoid stepping on visible traps. Often. Often. When battling several foes, the Pokemon will first target that have type disadvantage. Sure. Oh, efficiency expert. Oh, no, no, that's more important. We kill. We kill fast. Status checker. If its target has a status problem, the Pokemon will not use that cause the same status problem. Sure. Non-trader. Thank you. Quick dodger. Becomes better at evading attacks and stuff. Why is that not on? And type advantage master. The Pokemon's critical hit rate is boosted when attacking foes with a type disadvantage. Oh, because there can only be one, so that's... Either this is the maximum amount of IQ that we can have active at one time, or it is just, oh, this one and this one contradict each other for some reason, which could be fair. <laughs> now, let's see. Just in case. Status checker. I don't really have status... Well, with that out of that, let's go down the road. We could go scrounging for items. Fuck, run! I don't want it to use poison sting on our client! Just, we just need to kill you. You're in a bad place, and I don't... I just know that if I went up to be like, I will protect the diagonal, my client would be like, Oh, I, I want to get on this action and fucking die. Might you please stop? Arbok Cobra Man. <laughs> Will Kill! 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 Oh! The client was about to be eaten by living fire snail. Ah, oh, shit. Kill it for me, will ya? Leave the salad alone! He is the poor salad boy! Got him. Oh, hey. Yes, please, take your wife and be gone. Now we can explore. Without fear. As much fear. Hello, Magma Snail. I am no longer afraid of you. Because the weak handicap consultant is gone. Yeah, but while we're kind of in, in the uh, vicinity of that previous thing that I said, why did they get rid of normal attacks? That's one of the things that kind of put me off Gates and I think maybe Super a little bit is that, well, I think Super did it. I don't know. It's been five billion years, but they just got rid of the normal attack, or at least they did their damnedest. The normal attack only does five damage in uh, Pokemon Super Mystery Dungeon and gates to infinity. I'm still going to play them and give them a fair shot now that I have opened up my mind to the greater potential of reality or some bullshit. But, yeah, it's just... I, I, for me, it just feels like the moves are used for very specific situations or just, uh... Like, you save, you save stuff. You save your power points. And then the games are just like, actually, we want you to use moves all the time. Which is bullshit. Secret power. But how is it secret? It's on a compact disc. I'm gonna throw a rock at you. Haha, <laughs> I'm funny. That magma cargo is gonna die. Give me your money! Or whatever you have, and then I'll take the money behind you. Ah. Ah, shit. <laughs> ah. 
And then fear. Ah. <laughs> and then the Rhydon died. Nom nom, bitch. But yeah. I'm gonna have to use a lot of Ginseng. Like, go and super link all the moves together. And then just chug Ginseng. Because I want to level up my power. Yeah, you can kill him. Kill him, boy. Leave my boy alone. And then I think we'll go ahead and evolve Shane into uh, Grovile at the very least. Because, ah, uh, stat improvements. At least I think you get stat improvements when you uh, evolve. At least in this game. I know you do in the main game the main series, but I'm unsure evolution's effect, though I think that's kind of what they were implying. No, actually, evolution also makes you stronger, as well as changing your body. And because I want to become an Umbreon, we will have to wait a while until I get a Lunar Ribbon. And I don't know where Lunar Ribbons spawn or drop. We'll just keep an eye out for them. We'll just keep an eye out for Lunar Ribbons, and then Shane's gonna go on a murder. Yeah, you go murder. You kill that right on. Wow, you basically just beat him up a little bit and just like, <laughs> you think you can survive? Bullet Seed. X-Ray Specs, super neat. You kill him, boy. You murder him. How dare you poison the poison. A Pokemon's just gonna... Sp ah, we're getting hungry. Meh. Ah, that wasn't really all that worth it, but... We'll go ahead and eat a normal apple. That's why Stamina Band is best banned. It just freaking lets you just go and do things. Oh yeah, I think there's an IQ move... That literally just lets you walk through walls. I don't know why, but you can. black gummy for you. It doesn't seem to dislike this gummy. It's such an odd way to put it. But I guess they don't want to put it in a negative term, so kids aren't like, oh, that's not his favorite, I can't use it. But if it's like, it's not his least favorite, then kids will continue to use it and not be like, I am torturing my friend. Well, yeah, basically, we need to just chug up some gummy power. Just chug a lot of gum gum. Become intelligent. Create the Intellivision. Because it's intelligent vision. Yeah. You can't hurt the salad. You must die. What are you gonna do? You gonna explode, Golem Boy? You gonna explode, Golem Boy? You don't have it in you, do you, Golem Boy? Hello, Yugi Boy. Ride on, boy. Do not ride on the boy. He's bad. Well, we'll go through the magma infested caverns. And apparently the exit is in the one place we didn't go. What magic? What magical magics? But yeah. And I'll also have to take control of Shane to use the Ginseng. No, maybe. I'll be paranoid. A part of me is like paranoid. Yeah, I'll just I'll just kill you normally. Die. Mm. 
Magma Cavern, Basement 17. B-17 Floor! And we just need to spend all our money on ginsengs, gummies, and friend areas. You dare. <laughs> you killed it, it through. Yes, kill your friend. Shadow Ball. Lol. You, you attacked four times and you missed twice. You're a 50% failure. Come help me kill these dudes. Shadow Ball, I guess. <laughs> and not to be outdone, Shang was like, and now I shall bullet seed. A part of me kind of just wants to pour all of the ginseng into Shane, purely because of bullet seed. But it's unreliable unless I, like, forsake my main Pokemon and make Shane the temporary leader and then never make him not leader. What? I became terrified. Oh no. That was weird. Do it again and I'll kill ya. For fun. How dare you use poison sting. You monster. You must die for your heathenous sins. I am now poisoned. Right at the exit. Oh no, what will I do? Om nom nom. Shane just eats a giant rock. You want that slime to go away? Just scream at it! Scream! For the love of God, don't use, like, Magnitude or anything. Golem man. Or you can just die to Shane. Golem on his daily commute. Walk, walk. Walk, walk. Walk, walk. Gets eaten by a plant. Please do not explode. Here's a Shadow Ball for your troubles. Why is it that I've only ever really seen Graveler use Explode? Whenever I come upon a Graveler, I will always just be like, Are you gonna just fucking explode me? With the devious eyes, it'll look and promise pain. Hey, we have rescued you. And since we're getting low on... Diddly dee, we might as well leave now as well. We can't kill this ride on, but oh well. Woot woot. Thank you for escorting me. And because this was, oh, a person band. 150 points because it was rank A and an escort. Or maybe it was just because it was rank A and escorts are just usually like a higher rank thing. That was good work today. I should get some rest. My buddy boy isn't even here for me anymore to say we did a good job. Ah! Apparently they fixed that. In apparently that was such a negative thing that they were like, hmm, we should probably fix that. People weren't happy that their partner was just like, I was so sad that you left. Now I'm never going to visit you ever again. Well, except for story beats, but you know. You know, you know. IQ. Make your explorations easier by boosting the IQ of team members. Eating gummies boosts the IQ of Pokemon upon researching, uh, reaching certain IQ levels. A Pokemon learns IQ skills that can be very helpful. For example, learning to seek out foes with type disadvantages. Check the IQ skills for team members. Store. The range of moves. Moves that affect an entire room have a range of two tiles in a corridor. The move Growl, which lowers the attack stat of foes in a room, will reach two tiles away in a corridor, for example. If, however, the visibility is limited to just one tile, the range of the moves will also be limited. Oh, because... 
Are you still on my team? Shane! Shane, where are you? Shane! No, oh, there's the Shane. It wasn't yellow, so the guy gets scared. I will... Join team, I guess. And make leader. And let's visit me. How we got this place, we'll never know. But now let's go to town and talk to people as Shane. Apparently nobody cares about Shane. Oh yeah, let's check and see. Uh, job list. We need one aerial ace, so we need to see if we have an aerial ace. We probably don't. I would like to store a decent amount of things. Like this plane seed. These... We'll keep that. What is... Um, meh. Oh, well. I was gonna look at the person band. What does person band do? It's probably just like... Ah, from becoming confused. X-ray. X-ray. And this other power band that we got. Oh, and these, uh... These as well. And this link box. And now I will take out gummies. Oh, wait, I mean, now not store. I want to take out. Ah! And now we will take out... Let's see. Gummy, 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 gummy. I'll take those gummies and see what a green gummy is. Because it could be green gummy or grass gummy. Bug type. Knew it. Oh, Aerial Ace! We can do that mission if we want. I'll keep it here just in case, because I think I might want to go explore some of those other dungeons. I should think about evolving, but when I evolve, I become a Ludicolo. You know, Ludicolo is a carefree Pokemon. I don't know about having my personality become carefree. What do you think, huh? What's your rescue rank? How high'd you get? We're still normal rank. We're trying. Let's see. We have about 4,000. Do we have any money in the bank? I shall take, I guess. All of it. And see if there's much that we can buy. Friends are my treasures. Do, 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 do. Final Island. Southern Island. Why is Final Island cheaper than Southern Island? This legendary island may not even exist. Oh, yeah, that's for Mew. Southern Island. By Eon Pokemon. Latios and Latias. Should probably maybe buy that because, you know, legendaries... Also, apparently, legendary Pokemon have higher HP than they get when they become recruitable. And that's kind of sad. But apparently, if you throw them a Reviver Seed and beat them with a Reviver Seed, the stats stay. That'd be kind of funny to do, but I don't think I will. Just for, you know. 
don't don't want to break the game. Said to be deep inside a dungeon is the perfect place to store energy without expending any effort. Hmm. Do 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 Hmm. I'm interested in buying the Eon Pokemon one. It's had to be often visited. Well, if it's often visited, why do I get to buy it? <laughs> what if they visit and they're like, oh boy, I can't wait to go and do things on our favorite island. Sorry, this island was bought. What do you mean it was bought? It was bought. <laughs> Idiots. Do 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 Hmm. We could do Frosty Forest because Frosty Forest isn't that terrible. But we have to escort a bitch. You know what? I'm gonna do it. We won't be able to see his icon anymore. But I think it's time. Oh, come alone to enter, but I'm not even there. That's kind of silly. If my ally isn't going to follow me, why does it even have to be? It just should just be, hey, just be the team leader and go there. That's silly. It is very happy. Stand by. I can only evolve alone. Or at least in this case, Shane. But eventually when I, the Neon, Eevee, will also only be able to evolve alone. A voice emanates from somewhere. Ye who seek awakening, this is Luminous Cave. Do ye seek a new evolution? There are those among Pokemon that can evolve. Such Pokemon can evolve at this very spot if they satisfy certain conditions. Evolution brings about changes in appearance and abilities. Not only that, some Pokemon even change type and learn different moves. However, the requirements for evolution differ po among Pokemon. Some become ready for evolution merely by leveling up. Still others may need special items to attain evolution. Ye must also be aware of this. Once it has evolved, a Pokemon can never regain its previous form. That is why you must think carefully before committing to evolution. Go ahead and evolve, my boy. No. Because I don't think that Shane can give an item to evolve. I evolved! They don't even care that I evolved. But let's go check out now. I mean, since my boy isn't going to visit me that much anyway, it's not really that bad. Let's see how many jobs we have. Uh, two empty job openings. Racket band. We do have two sky... Two Sky Tower missions, but we don't have a racket band. Deliver racket band, so and the reward is just a power band, so meh. Anything else? Let's see. Frosty Forest, Lapis Cave, anything in here? I guess we could take the Mount Blaze missions but who oh, I know I have an idea next time that we uh, go down to do the uh, the team battle mission dungeons at the diddly diddly dojo we'll super link everything for the two it suddenly appears deep in thought. It's just like, oh god, he evolved. B 
but let's see. Now what do we do? We could either do the... I need to put my money away is what I need to do. But do we want to go ahead and do the dojo? We could do the dojo and beat up one of the teams and level up our abilities. Well, first I need that money for actually doing the thing. But... Proceed! Shane moves. Link. Link. And then we set it. Well, actually. Oh, yeah, that's another thing. It can only be done with set moves. And I don't. So we'll. Uh, no, thank you. I will like to take. At least, let's see, how many Ginsings do we have? We have three Ginsings. I will take two. And then when we return to being me next time, I will give the final Ginsing to me after superlinking all my moves. Go train. I will like to beat... Team Constrictor. Floor one. Great, we're on water. We're all gonna die. Well, first... Oh, first I need to freaking set my move. Set. And now... We go Ginsing. Info. A drink that boosts the power of the Pokemon set move. It may not have any effect on certain kind of moves. It also slightly fills the belly. In jest. Nothing happened! Hmm. Maybe they thought of that, and since Screech is at the top, it, uh, doesn't work. Hmm. Then we'll have to be careful and make... So that's probably how they get around you cheesing it. <laughs> that's probably it. Fair enough. I tried to cheese you, and you said, Enough of that. Get out of here. I could reset, though. Nah, I won't reset. Even if Ginsing is a rare item, I will accept my hubris pain. And then we'll probably just level up the bullet seed move a super lot. It does mean that we're gonna have to break the link, though. Oh, well. But let's go, me. No, I hit my friend. How dare you. I thought I had non-trader on you. On me. Or did the IQ moves... Yeah, non-trader. So it shouldn't have worked. Bastard. He's confused. The Pokemon wildly throw attacks will not hit friends. The game has lied to me. You beat him up. Quit using acid and die. We'll go ahead and throw a rock and beat you up. And here I thought I knew how to beat the game at its rules. Well, if I can just super duper link a move, but, but because Screech is at the top of the linked move and it's technically the one that is set, it's like, sorry, that won't work. Which, fair enough, I guess. I'll go ahead and beat you up. Even if we did waste a reviver seed in here. At least it's nice to know that they kind of thought, hmm, if they just can link moves together again and again and again, that would get kind of overpowered if they ginsinged a lot. So we'll make it so that there's kind of a ha-ha-ha, you failed. And here we go. Time to beat up the enemies. And then I'll just bullet see them all to death. Get lulled on. 
Christ, having the power of bullet seed in my hand. It is unbelievable. Oh, oh yeah, I got another Ginseng. Okay. Next, we're going to real or mess around with the moves. Unlink the moves, please. D-link. And then... Link. Bullet Seed. Set. Make Bullet Seed the ultimate kill gun. Uh... Alright, then you... Uh... Huh. Because Tackle is my go-to... We'll have to de-link this, but considering nah, 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 since it's just a simple and I'll be able to uh, de-link set. Would it work for allies? Because all their moves are set. Hmm. Uh, no, we should not. That should be everything. Thank you, my dude. And I forgot to eat, uh, the gummies while we were in there. But okie doke. Let's go on. Let's go beat up Team Hydro. And I'll be careful with my bullet seeds. Oh, how I just want to bullet seed you to death. Oh, how I could just bullet seed you right now. But okay, okay. Let's go ahead and fling about the gummies. You can have this. I shall eat the gold gummy. Me currently being my ally, which is weird. Eh, you can have the gray one in honor of it potentially being a normal. Non-sleeper, ooh. What be this non-sleeper move? Non-sleeper. Resist sleep from traps and moves, but gets rid of self-cure. Honestly, that one because we don't really get cured from like poison and stuff, so it seems not that many. But okie doke. Next up we have uh two ginsing. One for me. Yes. And uh I'll w uh, I hmm. Let's 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 continue to fuck around a little bit. Uh oh use. Damn it, they thought of that too. I figured, but I wanted to know. I wanted to know. Oh well. Cause if there was the possibility of grand supreme power, and I had to try. But I will play fair, and since I, <laughs> I will play fair and go fine, game. You thought of that. I won't reset to get my Ginseng back. Fair enough. I won't just be a twiddly little baby and go, wah, the game didn't let me cheese it to death. So, those Ginsengs are gone. I accept it. I accept my failure. I accept the game designer foresight. Sorry, no, you don't get to super power up multiple moves with one Ginseng. You can only power up one Gin one move through Ginseng. Understandable, fine. Now to annihilate another team with <laughs> just cheese the game a bit. Bullet Seed plus one! Oh. That's not good at all. These guys have uh, strong defense, huh? Oh no. <laughs> I 
Not enough to save him, though. I still have tons of bullet seed plus one, bitches. And you get the Mega Drain. Ha ha ha. And now you get Bullet Seed. I am the winner. And another Ginseng. Is it just in the inventory? It is. But okie doke. Do 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 do. But kind of annoying that we can only do... Like, we basically have to mess around in a lower level dungeon just to make sure that we can level up our moves better. Hmm. But I guess we'll... I'll go ahead and feed the next... We'll go to Frosty Forest. Get these two out of the way. We should have... Ginseng. I want to get rid of this plain seed. And fill up on another reviver seed because I killed my friend who was myself. I'm terrible. I would like to take out a revival seed. Donkey shame. I mean, if I really wanted to, eh, you know what, let's go ahead and beat up the dojo. Let's go beat up the dojo. Let's beat up the final thing in the dojo. It's a rock type. It might be a bit, oh no. Fear. <laughs> they might survive like that Blastoise did, but hey, screw it. We're gonna get plus two. Oh no. Alright. Tactics. Go after foes. Let's see. Screech and pound. Booyah. And make sure bullet seed is the set ability. Ginseng time. Yes. Plus two power. Thank you for not exploding. That was very kind of you. I'll just keep killing you. How dare you. Feed me, Rockman! How dare you. I said, FEED ME, ROCK- FEED ME! Rock boy. Besides, if I ever really wanted to just break this game in half, I could just do those, like, auto-quick-save glitch things to create my own dungeons. Bullet Seed, kill! Lol. And you come after Team Hydro? Bullet Seed, go! Plus, it's fitting now that I'm using Bullet Seed as Grovile. It just feels more fitting. And another Ginseng! Woot woot! But I'll put this Ginseng away until we can properly go in as the EV Neon and uh, level up Tackle. But let's head on. Directly to the forehead. 
to the Frosty Forest. And we get to play as Shane for a little bit. Ah, shit, we need to really... I forgot to bring Fate again. Fuck. We need to be careful, because we might run into hail zones. How dare you. I have rocks. A lot of misses. But I am the king of kill you. Oh, hey. Dig. And money. And gravel. This really is a good day. More gravel. Time to kill. Multi-kill. Multi-kill. Apparently this has also changed. Where, uh, apparent I forget what game. I was, once again, just me reading the Mystery Dungeon TV tropes. And I think it mentioned that in the, uh, remake, Mystery Dungeon DX... They changed it so that you can't kill multiple enemies with range moves that hit multiple times like that. And that is sad. They nerfed my boy. Get away from the client. You don't get to kill the client. I do. And I guess while we're here, we can put the power band onto Neon, since I don't think the stamina band works when on, I uh, on allies. If it does work on allies, I would desperately want to know, and then I would bring Fate along to forever be the Scarf Boy. The Stamina Boy. After all, who needs to actually eat apples when a sexy Absol is just standing there in a scarf? And while we do want to go... Oh, you're going to go murder something me? Good job. While we do want to go somewhat fast, we don't want to go blindingly fast. We do want to find money. I think, oh, for a moment I was just like, is that the ditto? Did it turn into our client? Does it want out of here? <laughs> Come here, mama swine, probably. Oh, hey, ditto. Die. When I am ma don't don't bastard bastard Let's see power band Pekka scarf Blowback orb warp out Nope nothing here But of course the goddamn So okay so, Mammoth Swine, or Pillow Swine, or whatever the hell, on sight. Fuck. <laughs> Quit spawning next to where we gotta go. We gotta go. We gotta go quick. I did bring uh, Aerial Ice, didn't I? Is that gonna be Aerial Ice? Nope, it's Brick Break. Would have been hilarious. <gasps> I didn't bring Aerial Ice with me. I am a fucking failure. It happened again! Don't you just love being like, I get to finally do this thing, and then you fail to do the thing? <laughs> well, at least that might give me an excuse to become Eevee me, level up my tackle with Ginseng, and then bring the frickin' normal diddle death. Death, death, death. I don't care if it's a corridor and it would only go two. Death. I said death. On sight. Now we can't do that because I'm afraid to hurt the uh, client. Yes. God damn it. 
I wish I could just, like, bring it from my toolbox wherever. Just now and eternal. Mammoth Swine, on site. Diddly dang it. Now let's just get out of here as quickly as possible so we can come back with the proper item. At least with this, this means that we can leave right this floor. Why are you acting weird? Oh. What? You don't look like you have... Yeah, I can't see the circle under you. Okay, oh, let's leave. Yes. A heel ribbon. And a max elixir. And a hundred points. Yep, no icon. Profound sadness. Also, now Shane is sleeping in my house. Well, I guess it's just the headquarter base, so... Meh. Shane does not think it's that weird to sleep inside my giant head. What is in here today? Well, there is another frosty forest. Let me check my job list. Hmm. We could get rid of the Mount Blaze. Let's see. It is a rank C. Should we be frickin' okay, yes, give. Why did I not never take that before? Sweet hands! Please don't. Teddy Ursa is often seen licking its paws that have soaked up sweet honey. While it may be sticky, shaking paws with Teddy Ursa, one can't help but feel a twinge of envy. The key! Head out to the desert region. If you've been wondering what lies behind the mysterious locked doors of the solar cave, there's been a breakthrough. Reports indicate the door keys are easily found in the desert region. Explorers are advised to compose teams of Pokemon adept to desert environment. Ha! Huh. Interesting. But okie doke. Well, I'm just gonna have to go in first. Me. Come along, me. And I guess I'll make you the leader now. Just to make things easier. Now that we don't have to do a diddly dee. I'll go unlink my moves and stuff. Dear me! You've run out of space! You don't know that. You can't look in my box. You're not allowed to look in my box. Because it's my box. Oh, I forgot to put the stamina band back in. I'm a germ! In fact, that's another thing. If I really wanted to, I could probably just do a Wonder Mail, make myself a Wonder Mail mission. And just let it be it. Hmm. Oh, we have two Ginseng. Since I'm the one that's going to be in the front for a lot, because I want to play as me, that's the reason I'm an EV. Then I will uh, level up my Ginseng a decent bit. G level up the Ginseng? No. Level up my... Bibbidi bop. Oh. D-Link. Ah, good. Then I would like to set this one. Can I just drink the Ginseng in here? I would like to leave. Nope, can't drink it here. I have been scammed! I would like to store all this money. We'll go do the Frosty Forest, get a friend area, get rid of that other thing, and then then we'll probably head to, like, uh, 
the southern cavern. Oh, well, then again, it's like, go here! Then we'll get the dive and go to the stormy sea, then. Because it says, hey, go there for story, so we'll go there for story. Or maybe we'll go for, uh... See if we can go to Mount Thunder and beat up uh, Zapdos again for fun. Well, let's go. Frosty Forest. I didn't activate the other one, didn't I? I didn't accept. Put that other mission on, did I? Oh well, oh well, oh diddly dop dip bap 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 bap. I am Big Fail Man, baby. Now I am Tackle Plus Two. We're just gonna go super fast. Because now I'm just enraged. 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 I am full of anger. I am full of rage at my own stupidity. Ah! What brings you unfathomable rage? Myself! What glorious day to feel overwhelming anger. It gives me a tingling energy that feels like a mild, very, very, very small fever. Ah! Why did you not pick up the money, Shane? I don't know how to use my claws. I evolved and it is very weird. I think the game is having... We are going to run into a monster mansion, aren't we? Okay, no, we didn't. Are you gonna be up here again? Yeah, you are. We find. Why do you even need this aerial ace, you stupid, stupid boy? Get out of here. Go home. Fall in the ice. Thank you for delivering the aerial ace. And I all I got in this for was a stupid reflect. And now the real thing, because I'm fairly certain I didn't activate the mission. So now let's go see if we did indeed did not activate the mission. And then we'll just uh, suck up the pain, relink my moves, and go to the Super C, I guess. At least this also gives me the ability to grind uh, off-panel, I guess. Off-panel, haha. <laughs> Probably because I thought the mystery things would show up. Two more frosty forests, huh? Azurel, the mighty little hero. With a simple act of courage, Azurel became a hero. Despite being small in size, Azurel came across Slowpoke, who had fallen into a pond. Our hero's tail, thrown at the struggling Slowpoke, saved her drowning. But it's a, it's a water Pokemon. Slowpoke claimed to have entirely forgotten having the capability to swim. Ah. All right, you give me 600. You give me a special band plus. I'll accept you. Oh, we did activate it. I am a dumb baby. What would you give me? A Reviver Seed Plus. And then that one's a double. Yeah, so we'll just save the other one. We'll mark you. I should have gone forward. I am I am the dumb baby. I completely forgot I had the capability to actually be a the decent rescue team member. Person. Well, at least this reminds me to grab another reviver seed, and then the, and then I'll do missions off-panel, as it were, as I keep saying for some reason. I haven't even been watching a lot of Linkara. What's wrong with my brain? But uh, we'll link, relink my moves, and then we'll go. I would like to uh, relink my moves. Oh, yeah, and thank you, 
Link. Link. Booyah! We'll go grab Shane and Dive. We need to grab Dive. Because luckily, you just have to have it with you. Let's see. Dive, dive, dive! We need you. Well, let's go to the post-game. The obligatory, hey, post-game is here. Oh, wait. Wait. Before we do, I'm actually going to go to Mount Thunder. Instead, I'm going to go to Mount Thunder. I'm going to see if I can beat up, uh, if I can beat up Zapdos. I'm going to go to Mount Thunder and see if I can beat up Zapdos. Because it's the smallest of the mountains. And should have Pokemon that's easy to beat up. I still love the music! Oh yeah, I forgot. I need to put on my... Stamina Band. Punch! They're two in a row, so they must die. Rock. How dare you dodge my rock! Quit dodging my rocks! My rocks! When an enemy just dodges all my my rocks, it hurts my soul. Take this, Weedle. I said take this, Weedle. And then the Weedle died, and I laugh at its face as it cried and be like, Why must you hurt me? Because you're an ugly little worm. You're an ugly little worm, and nobody likes you! You're an ugly little worm! I don't even know what I'm feeling anymore. Making the same mistake of forgetting a TM. And going on a mission. Only to be compounded by the fact that I then went and, uh... Did in fact agree to the hey friend area mission and thought that I didn't because I already made one mistake earlier Causing me to doubt myself made me then think that I actually am a big failure boy and That I did not accept the mission that was required When in fact I did No You wouldn't like me when I'm angry. I don't know if we have a area that accepts Zapdos. But we'll have to see. Maybe Zapdos just appears in a, a normal electric friend area. And I think I have a decent selection of friend areas that a Zapdos might like. Or maybe I haven't unlocked the ability to fight them yet. Time will tell. Let's see if we can indeed beat up a man or not. We beat him up once before. I probably should have went as Shane Grovile McGrovileson for this. So that I can just annihilate the legendary if I so chose with my plus two bullet seed. How dare you try and kill my friend. He is my friend. And you are ugly. Still love the music in this game. Just my props to the composers again. The, com the music in the Pokemon Mystery Dungeon series is always really good. Okay, thank you for not wasting your super powerful bullet seed on a near dead Amphros. We're just going super speeding through. Because we got a Zapdos to see if we can beat up again. And I guess we should also... It depends. Because we did kind of agree to... For Articuno and Moltres that we were going to stop the disasters. So maybe they have something to say now. I don't know. Really it depends if Zapdos is here or not. Hey, money. Decent amount of money. Wahoo. Saying that, happy things. Klonoa's getting a remaster, I think. I think it's a remaster. 
both for the first game and the second game. Super Wahoo! We need more Klonoa games. This Klonoa's a good character. How dare you try and burn the Eevee! Level up time! Woo! Look at all those ones. Woo! I am now paralyzed! My muscles are aching! I am <laughs> rapid thunder shock! Just do, do, do. <laughs> Meanwhile, Shane is just staring, looking at me as I suffer. I sure would like to save my adventure. Sure, why not? We're here. Hibbledy bibbledy. Save of the D. And even now, I'm all on my own lonesome. You thought that you were scary. You're not scary. I'm scary. And now I am paralyzed. Oh, God. Ah, my muscles. What even? Here, stairs. We're looking for stairs. Have you seen them? No, they're not a naturally occurring thing in the world. We must kill them. Destroy them. The water looks really nice up here. Kind of jade. It just looks nice. Probably not something you'd want to drink. Like, it doesn't really seem like a drinkable. But it does seem nice. Kill him. Kill the boy. The monster mash begins today. Oh, is that a grass? That better be a grass to give to my boy! It better be a grass to give to my boy. It's grass to give to the boy! Throw! He didn't learn anything. But hey. An electric one for me! And I got the Weep Tights Pipperger. No idea even what I said there. How dare you try and kill me. I shall now instead kill you. How does it feel? Well, let's see. Will Zapdos Zapdos or will Zapdos not Zapdos? Zapdos is Zapdos! So you're back! Since we last met, how much have you furthered your team? How much stronger your power... Demonstrate it for me! I forget what voice I gave the boy, man. Let's go together! Move! Shinnable! And now, you will die! Damn it! Keep lowering his accuracy! Keep lowering his defense! And keep smacking him with my head. Wow, you were a weak little bitch. That's funny to me. That amuses me. That, that is an amusing thing to me. I forgot to save. Me dumb. So I guess that proves that either I don't have it. Yeah, because I think, uh, I guess maybe I just don't have his friend area. Profound sadness. I think they do respawn so that you can get them in the team, but time will tell, time will tell, time will tell, time will tell. Time will tell. Dungeons and weather. Sunny boosts fire type moves and weakens water type. Regularly inflicts damage except on ground, rock, and steel. All moves and attacks excluding the normal type are weakened. Mm. Rain boosts water type moves and weakens fire and explosions. <laughs> Pekka Scoff, top popularity, bullshit. Among rescue teams, there is a growing demand for equipment that is not only practical, but also fashionably appealing. The pink Pekka Scarf is especially popular. Even the Kesleyan shop is having trouble keeping it in stock. If you're lucky enough to spot one, make a beeline for it. Can I, can I sell it? Can I sell it to the team? Uh, not to the team, but can I sell it to the uh, Kesleyan bros and they'll pay a premium for it then? Maybe, let's go see. Let's see if they'll pay a premium for it. They probably won't because they're the bitch. Bitch bastards. Whoa. 
But we will see. We will see. See if they are trustworthy, of which they are probably not. No, I want dive. Dive is important. Put away a few orange berries. And uh, quickly go around and see. Friends are my treasures. Is there any like electric seeming? Furnace Desert. No. Age Chamber Anne. Hmm. The ruins, the ruins, on the town. Let's move about this in next place. So yeah, that's basically, hey, you want some unknowns? Hey, you want some unknowns? Ancient Relic. I guess that makes sense. Mount Cleft. Aaron. Sacred Field. Yeah, but it doesn't seem that we have access to the legendary birds. Friend areas. Profound sadness, then. But we'll go ahead and put away my money. And we'll build up until we can buy even more m friend areas. All right, uh, Shane is in the team. Let's go to the place that it's telling me to go. Stormy Sea. Out into the sea we go. Oh, uh, we don't get an introduction. Interesting music. Kind of makes me think of a tense... Uh... Alright. How dare you. Kind of makes me think of a tense... What is it called? Ace Attorney Phoenix Wright scene. Oh dear god, these things have defense. Now this is really feeling Phoenix Wrighty. I'll throw rocks at him. Yeah, this really feels Phoenix Wright. We probably should have leveled up more. But at the same time, I thought that interesting tiles would appear while I was out in the new areas, because I think a thing said, new tiles have been discovered. So, so I thought that would do a thing. Wingle, we haven't seen you at all. Oh crap, these actually do damage. Ah, uh, you are absolutely given the go to use these. Absolutely, positively, you have given. You are given go to murder. Ooh, an escape orb. We don't have to die. Yay! Oh no, not not Ornberry. Golden Gummy. That is not a lot of money for a super dangerous place. Why? Why in the world must you do that to me? Oh, the escape. But the escape is in the orb. And that's the... Charge on, charge on. We don't want to risk too much here. We don't risk too much here. We're going to run into a goddamn monster mansion. <laughs> Wait, items. Yay. Is that a... It's a motherfucking blast shot. Shadow ball. Fuck. Why is my shadow ball so missable? Oh, hey. More money. Now that you're out here, beat up this clam. Clam, Klim, Clam, Klim. Die. <laughs> Tackle plus two. 
<laughs> that reminds me of... <gasps> Grass gummy for the boy! That reminds me of, uh... A George Carlin bit. Oh, what the fuck? It's, it's, it's evil shrimp of the hell past! Destroy! But in his, uh, save the fucking planet, are you kidding me? Kind of, uh, speech. It's just like, the Earth will just incorporate plastic into a new paradigm. Earth plus, pra Earth plus plastic. Which is like Earth plus two. Yay, level up for the boy! Ooh, a new move. What is it? Agility. We I thought we forgot that. You if you forget it. Maybe I guess there's no real but at the same time you're an NPC, but mm, info, what does it do? Movement speed, which means that we might be able to attack more. Fine, we'll get rid of Mega Drain since we can't super link it with Ginseng. So, and really, all Ginseng, uh, Mega Drain is, is, uh. Bit about, yeah, sure. Fine, fine. We can learn things again another time. Oh, we. Oh, I forgot. I, I didn't read his new level up speech. I am a failure of a friend. He probably was practicing it all day yesterday. But at the same time, he slept in my house and he wouldn't even let me sleep there. Lol, you headbutt me and you failed. Now you're extra dead. <laughs> I forgot to check and see if the boys wanted to buy pick a scobs! Now I get to go multiple times. Okay. Agility might be uh, somewhat helpful, even if he's probably going to spam it a decent amount outside of imperative combat. I'm gonna throw a rock at you because you're ugly. Aha! Uh -huh. You fell for the trick. Or he's gonna use it in immediate combat in which he probably could have killed the enemy. But at the same time, it helps us avoid damage a decent bit, I guess, so. Eh, nah, nah, nah. Nah, nah, nah. Do, 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 do. Na, 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 na. I forget this song. Yeah, this is some Phoenix Wright ass music. How dare you harden in front of me? Now you must die. Bit of a waste of the bullet seed, but oh well. All right, you can have the blue gummy. I'll take the purple gummy. Nom nom nom. It matches my eyes. I just have the best eyes. Ow, you hurt my soul. Now you must die. Oh, hey, another gummy. And another downward spiral. Kill! Destroy them all. With its weird X mouth. You've heard of X Men. Now get ready for X mouth. Nobody wants them, not even Marvel. Oh, hey. Why do you look so tiny? Why do you look so frickin' tiny? It feels like I'm beating up a child! What is with you? Why are you so hideous and ugly? I prefer it if you'd stop that. Shadow Ball! Probably should have done that from the start. The deeper we go, the further and further I'm like, okay, when is the surprise gonna happen? When am I just gonna run into Kyogre down here? Ah, green gummy! How dare you! 
Look, you got Shane's hopes up. He thought that he was in for a super treat of grass gummy. All he got was a po not even poison, but bug gummy. Oh, just music remix? Like not remix, but reuse? We had that unique Phoenix Wright bopping music. And then Please stop, we're not gonna kill him. Will you stop using your agility? <gasps> Shane, please. Wait, this is... This is... What is it? I'm trying to think. Trowel orb? What the hell is a trowel orb? Pulls all items on the floor to the user. Beware, if there is a shop, the user will be considered a shoplifter. Okie dokie. But yeah, why the... Ah. I see. I'll go ahead and use that troll orb. A pass? A hold item that can enable the Pokemon to pass off the effects of attacks and certain kinds of hostile moves to a Pokemon next to it. Also makes the belly go faster. I don't like those. Not to mention, I guess it would be decent if you had a Pokemon whose ability, like, allowed them to just ignore certain things or they just, like, take poison damage and make it into something useful. Meh. Will you please die? Go home! Be gone! Ugly fossil boy! Shut up, angry fossil boy man! We must get out of here, quickly! I don't know why the music changed, though. And changed to a previous dungeon... Shane, why are you being stupid? Maybe I should hold, like, okay, from now on, I will turn on agility when we need it. Well, hey, look at that. It's a max elixir. That'll help us uh, get boost if we need it. Okay, I didn't even see the slowpoke. Good job. You've murdered a man five billion years away. Die. Die. <laughs> Die! <laughs> Thank you for playing musical chairs with me today! What's this move? Frustration. I think the game is mocking me. Normal type! It's been white gummy this whole time. Trap avoider. Exactly what I want to see in a leader. Being able to look at something and go, that's cringe. Let's keep going down, because I'm scared for my life. Hmm. Luckily, they're all gummies. I'll eat the clear gummy. Ah, uh, it's just a green gummy anyway. Num. Shadow Ball, because you're ugly. Let's go. Let's go, Billy. <laughs> I just noticed the feel just roll about. That's hilarious. I like it. Especially funny because I ran into a rolling spheel in Pokemon Legends Arceus. So it's fitting as well. Even if all these ones are now being just absolutely brutalized. I would like to move. I would like to not die. 
Save me, my friend. We must kill this megalomaniacal monster. And what's this? Twist band? What are you? Prevents the Pokemon's attack and special attacks from going down. Ha! Huh. You can have this blast seed. Sfeel! How are you feeling today? Too bad you're dead. <laughs> Oh, now they're throwing interesting things at me. What's this? Cleanse Orb. What are you? Sticky, gummed-up items are cleansed of grime, making them usable again. I don't like the sound of that, that items can be grimed. Troll Orb. Well, might as well. Use. I need to increase my IQ. That Pokemon just made a big mistake. He's now dead. That's the mistake. What's a goal? Hello, Sfeel. You must die for your crimes against humanity. I prefer it if you'd stop wasting that, because we're gonna run. We're probably gonna run into something! Maybe. The game wanted us to come here and that boosts an evasion. Hmm. Maybe. Maybe, maybe, maybe. Is there anything I'm willing to sacrifice in here? Pekka Berry. Goodbye, Pekka Berry. You are murdering innocent fields when they are not a threat to us. What's this orb? Scanner orb. That might... Use. Yeah, sure, I guess. Alright, not that many items. We have to kill this bastard. We don't trust him. He's ugly and he's old. Ah, fuck. Why you do that? You're just wasting your bullet seed. How's my moves coming along? Not terrible. Gold ribbon! Gold ribbon. We can sell this gold ribbon. It's worth a lot of money! Sorry, I'm not gonna let you get a hit in, Shane, because you're just gonna waste e Fear, fear. Help! Help! Die! Sfeel monster, go away! Basement 20 prey! Hmm. Ah, I wanted to look <laughs> Kinda sad. Can't do it at my partner's feet and let them eat off the floor. Maybe they have standards. Until they become leader. Okay, good. Because <laughs> if the only way he could have attacked was by bullet seeding, he probably would have. Exit time. Whoop, whoop. There we go. Never mind, it's going to use it anyway. Please save some of those bullet seeds for the boss. Because it's going to be a boss. This has to be where Kyogre lives. Even if it's deeper down than Groudon ever was. Fuck, now I want to go kill every Sfeel that comes my way. And these floors aren't the biggest... Fine, I'll kill him! I wanted to save some of my power points, and the game was just like, how dare you try and be frugal. F well, not frugal. Thrifty. How dare you try to be swifty! 
You will suffer for this injustice. No, not you. Where's the spiel? God damn it. It's a gold ribbon. It's very valuable. <sighs> ah, fuck. Help me. Thank you. Wrong fucking spiel. Sadness. We are doomed to leave behind valuable golden band. Dang it. Wrong diddly dee. I wanted to do this. Why must you haunt me, you Billy Bob? You're wasting all your bullets, eh? Screw it, we leave. Why are there so much grime? -a? And no more bullet seed for us because Shane is a dunce. Oh, hi. Fuck. The Grim Reaper is here to eat me. Seeing just ancient Pokemon like Kaputops is always scary. Even if they're not really that powerful, they're still scary. <gasps> Grass Gummy! We must fight for this. Let's see if I can throw it. Woot woot. How dare you minimize. You will not minimize your chances of, uh, of failing. And we're just going deeper and deeper. Watch it all the fucking grablers. I should have brought more max elixirs. Ah, shit. Now my things are low. Quit. Why you use it through a wall, you stupid idiot? Hmm, Pounce Orb, don't care. We move on. Beat up more kaboos. I have half a mind to save the elixir purely for the boy so that he can use his uh, uh, bullet seed if we do come across the boss. And no troll. Well, we, there might be a troll orb somewhere. But since I was dumb, I need to use my moves more because I'm not the one that's almost about to break the chain. Oh, Starmie! Interesting. Starmie blinked? Why is Starmie blinking? What does that mean? What do you mean? Now I have five more moves. Ah, oh, fuck. I'm being targeted by the dragons. Help! Billy! I'm being assaulted by dragons! Yeah. 
It's a go. Onwards and downwards. How much money do we have? 3,000. Nice. How deep is this sea? Rock. Rock. How dare you rap me? Oh, that's not good at all. No, we have to awaken this bastard to get on through. And a Kingdra came out of nowhere. The steel chair. What the hell? Beat him up. Beat him up, 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 beat him up. You know, I just realized I could have just taken Bullet Seed off oh, as an ability that he sh the AI is told to use. I am dumb. Or at the very least, I'm not good at micromanaging AI. Which basically means I'm going to have a terrible future. Oh, you're going slow. Don the fireman. Fireman. Whoop. Slide to the right. Beat up the Skabootops. Whoop. Now we must beat you up because you're ugly. Release mine, friend. He is not your friend for angry hug. Kill. Kill the dragon. Why'd you become fucking poisoned? What the hell is wrong? Are you a poisoned dragon? What is wrong with you? Why do you get into fights in the public if you are poisoned? You bitch! I can make a run to it. I can make an escape. I can make an escape. Escape. Down the floor we go. Oh, hey. In Somniscope. So it probably makes it impossible to get turned to sleep. Oh, hold on. It prevents the Pokemon from going to sleep, napping, having a nightmare, or yawning. Interesting. This star me must die. Actually, I know. A tentacle has stolen the insomniscope. Bastard. Quit using swift. Quit getting swifty on me. Either way, we're gonna have a fun time at the boss. If there is a boss. Considering the game said, hey, go here. I can only assume there's a goddamn boss. Hey, level up time. And learn a new move. What's the move? Baton pass. Successfully switches the user's position with the positions of other Pokemon in the room. Ah, oh, that's kind of lame. Well, I mean, it would be kind of useful in that one time that we got into a monster mansion. But otherwise, yeah, kind of lame. My hands in a grow. I'm gonna use this. Uh, max. Oh, we have two max elixirs. I've been dumb. I'm gonna use them both. Not on me, of course. I'm gonna share them with my boy. I should have used Shadow Ball. No, wait. Shadow Ball wouldn't affect you, would it? Eh, it's, no. Why not have time to change? Nope. Just normal.
Hmm, I wonder if I can throw it and he'll ingest it. Max Elixir, go! Alright, that's kind of scary. Let's see. Ooh, another Stam and a Bandama. And that's just money. Okay, I'm gonna do that thing. I'm gonna take Bullet Seed out of your move pool for now. So that you won't waste it too much. Watch, I was gonna say, watch this be the final level of the area. But it's not, so. The fun times continue to roll. Quit spitting water at me. Keep blinking away all you want. Ah, uh, getting dizzy from hunger. We must eat an apple. We must destroy it. It's a poison monster. I'm gonna throw a rock at you because you're ugly. Nah, just a green gummy. Uh, heal band. You're an evolved spheal, so we have to destroy you. I'm gonna throw a rock at you. <sighs> at least I had the brains to finally take Bullet Seed off <laughs> this move pool for now. Level up. Now let's see what he actually says. And so did my jumping power. Why must you hurt me? Why must you hurt me, you poison-giving monster bitch? We really must find our escape from hell. Escape from hell, we're searching for you. And hell is underwater. I don't know why there's so much water and we keep going down, but it's not filling up. It is very strange, the physics of this dungeon. We're almost at level 40. I hope it's not a 100. It probably is, but my memories failed me. I shall eat this gummy on the floor Because why not? We're probably gonna die I fear for my life I fear for my friend's life But I have rocks And that's what's important down here I guess I do not know what to expect from this hellhole of denizen water hell Quit body slamming my dude. Six. Six. That's literally 220 more than I had in that last bundle. It might not be grass, but it is still a gummy. Eat. 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 It might not be a white gummy, but I shall eat it anyway. Where is the end of hell in here? I do not know. I'll throw a shadow ball at you because you're ugly. I'll throw another one because why not? Ah, shit. I thought this would like uh, end by now, but it just keeps going. Defense scarf? Interesting. Another scarf. What are you? Patsy Bear? A hold item that boosts the Pokemon's chances of taking critical hits from enemy moves and attacks? 
I guess if you want to use bind a lot or something. Like, what is the purpose of that goddamn band? No time, we leave. Uh oh. Oh. My power is. My power is bursting! My infinite power! Oh no, it's Broly! My duels against Groudon left us both exhausted. I took to a long and deep sleep. All the time I waited, waited for my power to recover. And now, I'm on the verge of regaining my power. I am Kyogre, the Lord of the Sea. Witness the destructive force of my waves. Marvel at my awesome power. Yo, ugly. Shadow Ball. Oh, and Bullet Seed, it's off cooldown. Shadow Ball again! Haha, <laughs> perfect. Use it now, my friend! Use the Bullet Seed of Doom! Use the Bullet Seed of Doom! Can I not tell you to use it? I don't think I can. Ah, oh, fuck. Yes. Ah, oh, it only went twice. Ah, hell. Well, we did it anyway. Huzzah! We peed down, and that's it. We don't. We're not gonna talk about it. It was just Kyogre was down there, seeking to recover power and uh, potentially destroy the world, and we didn't let him. What the hell was that? That's kind of silly. But I did it. I win the day. I am the magical man of the Wonder World. Hell yeah. Pokemon news. Extra buried relic discovered. Mystery ruin found underground. Its site had been hidden by the crater of a meteor strike in ancient times. The buried relic is thought to date beyond recorded history. There are rumors of treasures and perhaps even Pokemon that lived in ancient times. The buried relic is in the main to is the main topic in Pokemon Square. Wobbly Wobbuffet wonders. Wonders. Early today, earlier today, Wobbuffet reportedly wobbled the wrong way and wandered off. It had to be rescued by famous Team Hydro. Fortunately, the wayward wanderer Wobbuffet was only wobbly and otherwise unharmed. So now everyone's gonna have new topics to talk about. Oh, so they're basically asking me to go after the the relic. He's like, you go after the relic, won't you? How can I deny? My dear, lovely Miss Kangaskhan. And I get to go sell this uh, golden band. Oh, it's isn't it exciting? Why, I wouldn't mind closing up the shop so I could tra go treasure hunting. And now... <laughs> Not much to say, huh? I forgot to look and see if you wanted uh, Super P.E.K.K.A. scarves, because scarves are in session today. It seems talk of the relic is on everyone's lips today. If you find any treasures, please do tell me. And now... Our team got the gold rank, bud. I think the rescue ranks go higher than that. I've heard that there are treasures to be found in the relic. I wonder how much is true, but I must admit, I do get a certain thrill from it. I guess there's a sense of drama and adventure about it. I heard rumors that Pokemon from ancient times live in the buried relic. I've already met Pokemon from the ancient times. I beat them in the sky and at the bottom of the ocean! Hey, have you heard about the buried relic? They're rumoring that there are treasures in there. 
and they say the treasures aren't just lying around on the ground. Know what they're saying? They're saying that treasures are even embedded in the walls. If you knock down the walls, there might be treasures galore. Something really en no enticing, eh? I think Triftree knows where the buried relic is. And the bastard ran away. If you find a fortune in the relic, save it here with me. <laughs> Silly Persian doesn't even care about owning it. It's just like, I want to guard it. That's it. I wonder what kinds of friends are in the buried relic. Friends are my treasures. I can literally buy the ancient relic. The ancient relic, the ancient relic. Meanwhile, Wigglytuff, would you like to buy the ancient relic? <laughs> Guess there must be different ancient relics. When will I get to gold? Oh, hey, I forgot you're over here. Papa still hasn't come home. Our son, sorry to make you wait. Oh, that voice. Get set. Ha! 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 I don't know where you've been, apparently. Papa! Our son, we're sorry for causing you anxiety. Papa, where were we you? We were traveling the world. The world is vast. There are countless Pokemon around the world that are unknown to these areas. That's why you were gone. Papa, did you see all the Pokemon that aren't known in these areas? Of course. What did you do take us for? Oh, of course. Papa, you're so special. You're lying, aren't you? What do you take us for? Oh, um, yes. <laughs> I didn't even know he was gone. But okie doke. Oh, hey, Shiftry. What's that? Where's the buried relic? The buried relic is deep in the jungle to the southeast. Are you dreaming about the treasures too? <laughs> Me too! Best of luck, compadre! Leaving aside the disturbing fact that Shiftry made them compadres. <laughs> Gained access to the buried relic. All right, what do you got to say? Ho, ho, ho. There is an old saying about the buried relic. Three parts there are, guarded by three disciples. When the three parts are gathered in hand, a mirage shall appear to the bearer. What this actually means, there is no telling now. Ho, ho, ho. Ah, so we went and beat up Kyogre. Huzzah. Your team has my support. Keep up your rescue work. And I'll quickly see if there's any new teams to beat up here. No new teams. But I want to beat up all the teams. You got anything to say about the relic? Nothing from you. Well, hmm, hmm, <laughs> hmm, I guess we will do one last thing, and we'll do Frosty Forest, and uh, from there, I'll probably do some grinding on my own. Just gathering up things, do my things, let's make sure that I don't need to take anything with me. Hasn't come back and I'm lost, okay good. To Frosty Forest, to open up the mission thingy. And I'll just uh, go ahead and do my own things. Level up my Pokemon so that we can go on more adventures. But yeah, the, the post game so far, at least that wasn't that interesting. It was just, you went down to this new hard-to-do dungeon and found Kyogre and beat him up. And since we don't really have much to do, I'll let you use all your moves. I didn't take off your other moves. Okay, I did. Here you go. I took them off just because I wanted you to use your norm- your- 
how dare you run from me? Wanted him to use Bullet Seed against Kyogre. Oh, hey. Yay. But yeah, I think just what I'll do is uh, do a bunch of normal rescue missions and avoid new areas, because it seems that there isn't anything... I forgot to grab a new apple. Fuck. But, yeah, it doesn't seem like anything new really happens, and, yeah, it's just kind of sad that the whole, oh, you can go and play as other Pokemon now, seems to override the story of the post-game. So it's more just, more dungeons and Pokemon, and sometimes re legendaries will be like, my power is, oh, my power, it's overflowing! Like Kyogre. So, that leaves a lot of uh, freedom for me to do what I want, at least. Oh, hey, an apple. Thank you. I was, I, was, I, was, I was wondering where an apple might be to replenish my apple supplies. But yeah, still kind of sad that, like, the... I think that is one thing that they kind of fixed, and they might have fixed as well when it comes to the partner long, no longer following you around, maybe, for Mystery Team DX. All the, all the more reason to eventually get around to playing Mystery Team DX in the future. But, yeah, really, it just makes me want to play the other Mystery Dungeon games. Just all of them. But I do have a lot of Pokemon games to play. I need to get around to doing Coliseum. So that is a thing I'll have to look into. Maybe I will just do, uh... Avoid trouble. When its health is low, avoid the first hit. If a foe comes close, the Pokemon will attack. <laughs> Get away, what's the difference between keep your distance? Whether friendly or not, that's kind of funny. I'll just need to think on what Pokemon game to do after I do this, because I could probably plow through a ton of the post-game if that's all the post-game is. Is, hey, a new area! You can get there by doing this! And then you can just go and do it whenever you want. Okay, good, I did put away my money. My money! But I'll need to decide what Pokemon game to do next. I could do Colosseum, I could do uh, Emerald. Yeah, it's basically that. It's either one of the side games or one of the main games. And there's a ton of side games compared to the main games, so... I have a lot of uh, choices, really. More than likely, I, eh, maybe I should do, like, before I head into the DS era properly. The only reason I went to Pokemon Blue Rescue Team was because I really, really wanted to play Mystery Dungeon. Because I love Mystery Dungeon, at least the main story so far. The post-game has been kind of... just... more. But it's the... it's the story and the characters, as basic as they were, that kept me playing. So... Considering that the post-game is kind of lackluster, I'll probably just do a ton of playing in my own time to level up Pokemon, gather money, buy friend areas, and stuff like that. And then, <laughs> considering that it seems that the post-game is just literally, oh, you beat the last post-game thing? Well, here, this is now open to you. Ah, Mighty Ina! Cool to see you. But yeah, since it's just, oh, you beat the last 
post-game dungeon. Well, now we'll open up another post-game dungeon for you to conquer. So more than likely, I'll just do a ton of post-game... Well, not even post-game. Just a ton of playing on my own, just doing normal missions. Because I doubt anything story-related will happen. But at the same time, I kind of want to get to gold rank to be able to... Uh, see what happens. Because surely, well, at the same time, that's probably why the, oh, there's ranks higher than gold aren't there, bibbidi B. So, it's possible that if you, even if you get to gold rank, you need to get to ranks beyond gold rank before anything happens within that. Mm. Well, I'll just make a note since I am playing on an emulator for ease because I don't have a capture card uh, Nintendo 3DS. Um, I can just make a save state and be like, oh, if I want to, I can just... <laughs> and that's one nice thing. If I don't want to uh, miss out on something and something begins to happen, I can just save state and come back later. Or, you know, just have to do one dungeon loop again. Oh, hey, Oddish. I forgot. This is a destination. Sure, let's go. Woot woot. Thank you for rescuing me. Here's your award, the Promise Special Band. And a gray gummy. And a purple gummy. And 40 points. Thank you for rescuing Oddish. Here's your reward, Dragon Cave. And 60 points. That was good work today. I should get some rest. And of course I'd like to save my... Why does it like... Would you like to save? And it says... Why would it default to no? Let's see what the news is today. Hello, Pelipper Pharaoh Chaman May. And let's see what we got today. Uproar Forest. Please take me with you. Friend area. Friend area. I should have taken that. I'm a dumbass. Clear, pleasant weather, hail, regularly inflicts damage except on ice-type Pokemon. Fog turns the status of all Pokemon on the floor to Mud Sport. Blizzard boosts the movement speed of ice-type Pokemon by one level. Interesting. But I do believe that that will be that for now. All in all, we didn't do too much. I forgot to bring the TM for a mission again. Because I am a fool. I am LeFou! And we went and got a friend area from a mission and beat up Kyogre. Because that's the post game of this game, I suppose. This really just makes me want to move on to Explorers of Sky, but I have so many other Pokemon games to get before that. But it is interesting that uh, Pokemon from, like, uh, the Generation 4, I believe? Because I think this is all Generation 3 stuff. Hoenn and Bibbidi Bop. But, uh, things like, uh, I forget what your name is. The, uh, the baby form of... Great, I forget that one's name, too. The rock tree that is all rock and no tree. But, it's nice that, like, thing, and also, like, the great explorer, uh, or rescue team leader, Lucario. Because I, I don't think Lucario is recruitable in this game. <laughs> I think it is just, uh, the, uh, Hoenn Pokemon, and none of the Sinnoh Pokemon are available. But it's cool that they are referenced in here, because it was being made, and this game came out first, and it's just, it's so cool. But it'll be interesting to see, like, how the post-games compare between Rescue Team and Explorers. But yes... I do diddly do think that shall do for now. My Ben Neon Ice Wings, and this has been more 
Pokemon Mystery Dungeon Blue Rescue Team. If you want more from me, you can hit me up on YouTube, where I try to make edited content once in a billion years at Neon Ice Wings. Or if you want to catch up on streams you might have missed, you can watch them on the archive channel Neon Icy Games YouTube. And uh, if you want, if you're already watching one of these archived streams on Neon Icy Games, you can watch me play these games live at twitch.tv Neon Icy Wings. When I don't know, because the start time is all over the place nowadays, and my brain is on fire. If you want to see me try and post art every once in a while, then you can follow me on Twitter, Tumblr, DeviantArt, and Newgrounds, where I try to throw my art that I create every once in a while. Far, far, far more than I do my edited YouTube content, at least. And all those are at Neon Icy Wings, except for the Tumblr, which is Icy Wings Art Corner. But yes, thank you very much for watching. I've been Neon Icy Wings, and I hope to see you dudes next time. Bye. Bye.